Hi, this is Serben and in this tutorial, I will show you how to compare variances for one, two, and multiple sets of data. Variance is a measure of variability and tells us the degree of spread in the data set. The more spread, the larger the variance to the mean. In this example, we have four columns representing four store locations, processing times. First, we want to compare one location's variance to a target value. Go to Stat, Basic Statistics, One Variance. Let's say we want location A to be compared to a target value. Place column 1 or the A to this blank space and then check the perform hypothesis test. Select hypothesized variance and let's set our target value to 9.0 or 9. Press the option. You can see the confidence level at default 95 percent that's okay if you want to change this you may and the alternative hypothesis you can choose between the three but i choose the less than hypothesized variance to see if store a variance is less than the target 9.0 or store A is more consistent than the allowed maximum target of 9. Press OK and then OK. In this window, you can see the null and alternative hypothesis statements, then the p-values for bonnet and the chi-square test. The p-values of both tests shows that they are less than 0 0.05 at 95% confidence interval. Thus, we reject the null hypothesis meaning store location A variance is less than the target value. Now, if you want to compare the variances for two store locations, so let's say for store A and store D, let's go to stat. basic statistics and this time two variances select each sample is in its own column because store A and store D are in separate columns for sample 1 we select column 1 or store A for sample 2 we select column 4 or store D. Click the options. Ratio is set at two variance. Confidence level is at default 95%. Hypothesized ratio is 1. And then the alternative hypothesis is you can select between the three, but we pick ratio is not equal to the hypothesized ratio of 1 and then just click OK and then OK we have this result and at the bottom we have the confidence intervals and then a box plot and in the right side we have the p-values of the two tests Bonnet's test and Levine's test the p-values are greater than 0 0.05 therefore we fail to reject the null hypothesis or store locations A and D ratio is equal to 1 now if you want to compare variances of multiple locations these four locations A, B, C and D 
we want to see if the four stores have equal variances go to stat since there are multiple locations we choose ANOVA for three or more groups of data and choose test for equal variances in this portion we will choose response data are in a separate column for each factor level because A, B, C, and D locations are in separate columns and in the responses we select all four columns then press OK we have this graph for four locations Visually, we can see the difference in the confidence intervals, although store A and D overlaps. The p-values are less than 0 0.05, therefore we reject the null hypothesis, meaning at least one variance is different. And in this case, we can see store C and D are significantly different to AD you can also check the uh, tests portion p-value is less than 0 0.05 thus we reject the null hypothesis hope you've learned from this lesson again thanks for watching don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel Sir Bren. See you next time. Keep safe and God bless.